downstream because the stream was so strong we found a nice little side spot thing that we're going to check out <laughs> all right i'm going to cast downstream back <laughs> let's see what we come up with Always on the lookout for a metal locked box of some sort <laughs> filled with gold bullion. Oh, it feels like I have some. What? I felt it pull against something. Maybe it's one of those big fish. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. uh, no. Here we are at the water's edge. Always remember, if you are magnet fishing, that safety is of utmost importance. I have no life vest. I have no water wings. <laughs> I have very little training, but I'm being very careful. Right, we have moved a little further down, closer to the Robin Hood plant. What is apparent is that Port Colburn has really clean water because we haven't found anything. And I'm starting to regret magnet fishing. <laughs> but we've moved down to where the like it swirls and eddies and flows. And we've also moved down to number three, which is a, hopefully a lucky number. We're gonna give her a toss. I think it's time to move on. I've exhausted my fun here and yours too, I'm sure. We're gonna head down the road, find a different place, see what we can come up with, and maybe we'll just plant some stuff. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> so, not the metal lock box. <laughs> Full of gold bullion that I was hoping for. Not the antique coins, but this is, what does it say? Controlled area, which makes me wonder why it's in there. But I now have three padlocks of various sizes no way to open them. A length of chain that is rusty. I would consider that a day well done. <laughs> <laughs> 